Hello, Cancerian. Welcome back to my channel. Okay. Ooh. It's hot. All right. We're doing your next 48th. This is going to be episode February 19 and February. I mean, sorry. February 18 and February 19 for Cancerian. All right, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Okay. If you have questions about personal readings for yourself, you can check the description box. Okay. Very simple to understand. I didn't write a whole, you know, life story or whatever, but. It's there for you if you want that information, okay? So check that, the description box for that information. Let's see what's going on with Cancerian. Sun, Moon, and Rising, your next 48. Let's see. See what's going on. All right, your overall energy we have the Five of Cups. Okay, so here's your energy. All right, feeling regretful, remorseful about something, living in the past. You regret not listening to someone, not heeding somebody's warning. Okay, let's see. Okay, the Death card could be a Scorpio. All right, and the next card, okay, the Nine of Cups. Yeah, I'm getting like you want to listen now where well, you did not listen. You didn't listen before, but now you want to listen. You've changed your mind. You had to change your heart. Okay, so I'm, I'm getting you're feeling a little bit remorseful now about something and you want to change. Okay, you're trying to make a change here. Okay, let's see. We have the Hermit. Okay, being antisocial. This is also to my social media card behind the scenes. Okay, we have the, uh, the the King of Pentacles, so it could be a, it could be a Cappy or a Virgo. Okay, easily. All right, and then we have the Five of Pentacles. Okay, so something is missing. You feel like you're lacking something. You just don't have something that you want. Yeah, I'm getting you could you could be with someone. Okay, you could be with this this, this King of Pentacles, and I mean it's great. They provide for you. Okay, it's nice. They're very generous. All right, but I'm getting it's still not enough. You still feel empty. You still feel lonely. You still feel lost on the inside. It's not fulfilling you on an emotional level or spiritual level. There's something just missing here. I'm getting, I'm getting this person could treat you very well monetarily, or maybe you have money, but like you have nobody to share that with, or, you know, you have nobody, you know, I'm getting that there's something that you want that you don't have. All right, let's see. What is the five of cups, please? Okay, the three of swords. Yeah, you're missing someone. I'm getting you're missing another water sign or you're missing. It could be an air sign as well, a, a Libra. Okay, what's the a death card? Okay, we have the seven of wands. Okay, I'm getting you're, you're tired of being defensive. You're tired of fighting. You don't want to fight anymore. But you do have your walls up. Okay, what's the nine of cups? Okay, the ace of cups. Yeah, you want a new beginning. I'm getting you want to open up this time. I'm getting you were you were very defensive last time. You had your walls up. Okay, but I'm getting now you want to open up. You're missing someone. You wish you you wish you would have opened up before or when you had the chance. Okay, let's see. But you were being kind of a hermit. You kind of had, you know, you, were, you had your walls up before. All right, let's see. Okay, what is the hermit, please? Okay, we have the five of swords. Yeah, I'm getting you were just doing what was best for you. You were protecting your feelings, protecting your emotions. At least you thought you were. Okay. Yeah, I'm getting you've been you've been uh, killing somebody with you've been giving somebody the silent treatment because you you know you think it's what's best for you. You don't want to get hurt. Okay, what's the king of pentacles? I'm getting two. You don't want to be used for your money. You don't. I mean, you don't want somebody just to have you know here because you have money or you're doing well or whatever. What's the king of pentacles? Okay, the uh, king of wands. Interesting. And what is the five of pentacles? The justice. All right. Yeah, so I'm, I'm getting you feel empty. You feel left out because you rejected this person. Or you did not you did not heed the warning or you didn't listen to someone. Or someone did not, did not listen to you here. All right. Let's go around again. But I'm getting you are going to have justice for this. The five of pentacles. It is going to balance out with the justice card. All right. So I'm getting now you're realizing that you should have listened or maybe you should have did something different. All right. So now you're, you know, karma's coming back. All right. Let's see. What's the three of swords? Okay. the uh, Okay. We have the queen of cups. All right. What's the seven of wands? Okay. The four of cups. And what's the ace of cups? The eight of cups. <laughs> yeah. So I'm, I'm getting like somebody was trying to give you love or show you love. 
Okay, but you just you didn't really you, you didn't want to take that. You could even block this person. I'm getting they tried multiple times, like three or four times to show you love, to open up, to be kind. And you kind of just blew them off. You know, it's not what you wanted at the time. It wasn't what you it wasn't what you wanted, or it's not what you want. Okay. Okay, we have the star card with the king of wands is the queen of wands. Interesting. And what is the justice card? Okay, the three of cups. I'm also getting to you are defensive here. You have your walls up because you're with somebody here. I'm getting to you are providing for this person. Yeah, there's definitely, there's definitely a third party here. I'm getting you are the king of pentacles here because I'm, I'm not, or here, here you are up here. What is this combination? Okay, the Ten of Pentacles, yeah. So this is somebody in your family, okay? So this could be this could easily be your family members. You have to provide, you have a family. All right. You have to provide for someone or take care of somebody. It could be multiple people. But I'm getting you are very abundant here. Whoever you're dealing with, they're very abundant. They're well off, established, decorated, something of that nature. What's the ten, what's the ten of pentacles? I'm getting too like you come from a very prestigious family. All right, let's see. Okay, the strength card, yeah. I'm also getting too. There is an earth sign here that you are really drawn to. Somebody, you find somebody. There's there's a lot of chemistry, sexual chemistry especially. What's the strength card? It could it could be a Leo combination of leo and earth okay what's the strength card i'm getting leo very heavy okay the four wands and i'm getting you live with this person you live with this individual this fire sign but i'm getting it's 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 a it's a lot it's based on sex and money and stability this is why you stay but i'm getting you feel empty on the inside but the relationship is stable it's it's abundant this person is abundant Maybe they take good care of you. They buy you nice things. The house is nice. Okay, you you live well. I'm getting the sex is good. But when you go to bed, it's like you feel the five of pentacles. I'm getting you could be part of a third party or something like that. And you know that you know that this person has multiple, this person's dating multiple people. All right, what's the three of cups? Oh, this is you. You're dating multiple people here. Let's see. Okay, the lovers, yeah. I'm getting I'm getting you're part of a third party situation, but you already know that. Like the person you're dating, they're dating other people, but I'm getting it's still stable. Like, you know, something here is it's, it's stable enough for you to stay. I'm getting it, there's money involved, it's abundant. All right. You have too much pride to leave, or you know, to you know, you don't want to change the situation. It's comfortable for you. Okay, what's up here with the uh, ace eight of, ace of cups and the eight of cups? The three of pentacles. There's definitely three people involved. I'm getting you already know about it. There's too many threes. Oh, this could be you. You could be dating multiple people here. One more card for the center. And we have the nine of swords. Yeah. But I'm getting you go to bed worried. You go to you go to bed anxious. You, you go to bed. You know, there's a lot of anxiety behind this. You're not. You're unhappy. I'm getting to you know this person is dating multiple people, and that worries you as well. You always have to worry about are they going to leave me? Are they going to leave me? Are they going to leave me? What's the lover's card? Okay, the two of cups. But I'm, I'm getting this is separate from this. I'm getting you. There's somebody you want to reconcile with. I'm getting it's a Libra. You, you mean, I'm, I mean, somebody that you want to, this person makes you feel whole. They balance you. They're very balanced. You're going from the five of pentacles. We have the Libra here or the justice or the scales. And then the three of cups and lovers and the two of cups. Yeah, somebody you're celebrating them. You're celebrating with this person, dating them. Okay, making up with this person. This is what you're wanting, I believe. Okay, they feel that void for some reason. 
What's the Two of Cups final card? I'm getting you are making up with this person in some way, shape, or form. They are a lover of yours. Okay, maybe they know about this. They know that they're a third. I'm getting there's there's multiple third parties here. You're part of a third party. You also have a third party. All right, let's see. Yeah, the Six of Cups from your past. This person's from your past. Okay, I'm getting you. You want to make up with them. But they are going to, they are, if you brought them back in, they are going to be a third party. But I'm getting, you already know them. You are familiar with them. They, they kind of fill that void. They give you what you need emotionally. All right. They make you feel like, they make you feel at home in your heart. All right. Yeah, we have the queen, the queen of swords. I'm getting us a Libra, double Libra. All right. But I do see you guys making up here. I do see you making up with this person. Are going out, dating, celebrating, something of that nature. Okay, yeah, on your phone. I'm getting it starts off as a text conversation. It starts off as texting or communication. Okay, so I hope this helps you. All right, Cancerian. Okay, don't forget to like the video. Okay, leave your comments and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.